was this year the event? Yeah, I think it was a really great edition. Uh, we had so good numbers, we had so many visitors, and the vibe was really, I think, exciting. Uh, you could see how positive energy now there is into the industry. People see a lot of opportunities, and they come all over to do business over here at the conference, and it was fully packed. And uh, it's great to see big DJs and managers and record labels to come over and see each other and to meet and to set up business. And uh, yeah, we are happy. In this year, we had many different conferences. You introduced at the green, for instance. Why you introduced at the green? Yeah, we think it's an important uh, topic to, to make people aware of the environment. And the beautiful thing about the whole scene now is that there's so much power in the scene to communicate as well to the young people and to educate and to tell them more. Uh, yeah, about responsibility. So I think this power can bring a lot of effort to, uh, uh, to the world. And it's inspiring to see that big companies like IDT, but also uh, people from Burning Man came over or South and Southwest to talk about this issue. What about the ADEF Pro, the main uh, body of the conference? Yeah, we have a great team working on all the topics and also we get a lot of proposals from the industry or sometimes from, arti from artists directly like Dave Clark uh, and, and it's funny uh, to see uh, the whole process and we always try to make it a positive vibe also amongst the panels and talk about possibilities and solutions for the whole scene so yeah. I think we Do you got have the favorite favorites. panel, maybe? The one that... Uh, uh, this year for me, it was really great to see now Rogers and Judge Moroda together in one panel. Those two heroes. Uh, and also talking together. So yeah, it was really a, a great moment to see that. Uh, you had also at the university. This year uh, you had sponsorship for some students. We are really proud to have been able to start this year with an intern program for students from Holland. Which means we gave the possibilities to them to have an internship somewhere at one of the leading events or companies within uh, this uh, music scene. So we have uh, we had an intern program in uh, in Brazil, one in uh, Aruba, one in uh, New York, and one in uh, India, for example. So the students were really eager to be part of this process, and now, yeah. We will send the next generation professionals all over the world, hopefully, to, uh, to learn from the scene and to share knowledge uh, on the globe. So we, we are really proud for that. Uh, also, you have a the next that was today. AD Next, dedicated for young DJs and professionals. And you see them getting younger and younger. So nowadays, the young kids want to become a DJ instead of a rock star. And it's uh, really amazing to see that. How old are you? Uh, 14 years old. Have you done any production? Um, yeah, a little bit. Do you have any artists that you aspire to reach? Uh, yeah, Afrojack and Hardwell. And do you like the Amsterdam dance event then? Yeah, I like it very much. Why? There's a lot of things to do and to listen. Yeah, we have about 85 locations every day and they are fully packed and uh, also during the daytime we have big parties like in, uh, in the Milky Way it was fully packed this afternoon at 4 o'clock and uh, it's interesting to see that more and more off locations are uh, joining the event so we have really special locations part of the program and also the concert hall for example uh, so yeah we are pretty happy with that. And today you have the Amsterdam Music Festival that brings IBNT with all the... With this we are able to attract more uh, tourists to come over to the city and they understand these kind of uh, big events with, with this line, uh, uh, line up so it's definitely interesting to see that and also uh, over there there will be the 
But DJ Mechtop uh, 100 Awards show tonight. So we will see, uh, hopefully, we will, who is going to win. What are the future plans of the people that the work 12 months to prepare such a wonderful organization and have everything together and attract great sponsorship? I mean, Samsung is uh, coming and uh, hiking the whole event and supporting the whole event. What we did all over the years is to make every aspect of the event more uh, uh, professional and more powerful. So that means, for example, the intern program. This year we started with four students to send them over, but next year definitely we try to bring ten uh, around the world to have this great experience. And uh, uh, so on every level we try to uh, 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 make this event better. So. Uh, and for upcoming years, yeah, we have some small ideas, like uh, uh, I thought it would be nice to start a documentary program and ask every country around the globe to send over one documentary. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. So, so you can Festival. see in five days, uh, or in uh, 80 hours, 80 uh, countries and their club culture. Oh, and and, uh, and yeah. that would be such a great uh, marathon uh, to, to achieve. So that kind of ideas maybe or might happen next year. Medical Wild is like the publication of a book that is uh, part of IB because it has also a chapter about um, the Dan Dance event. The book Medical Wild was really impressive. Uh, the people who made this book, it's such a big book and uh, they worked for two years on the book because this is the moment to say, okay, this is what we have done the past 25 years over here. And, uh, yeah, we did a presentation at the start of the event and uh, yeah, it was really emotional because the old generation joined as well and the new generation over there and uh, yeah, it's really great to see and to see how powerful also the Dutch scene is of course. Thank you very much uh, for your time, thank you very much for having us. Thank you. Thanks very much.